Hi there everyone, welcome to Technoholic. In this video, we will talk about how we can utilize our iPad as a secondary display, especially the wireless display with Microsoft Windows. And that too for absolutely free. There is no subscription plan, no one-time charge. This is possible through an app that we're going to talk with you about in this video. And then uh, what we can achieve actually here First of all, we're we going to make the whole Windows experience touch. So if I touch here, you will see that um, my menu appears and then sometimes, you know, people may think of why we cannot access desktop grade app inside iPad. So that is also possible. Let's say um, if I try to open here VS Code, we can do that. Not only VS Code, for example, app like AutoCAD let me quickly open AutoCAD that I can see here on the bottom I simply need to tap on it and seems like I already have opened it and there we go now um, what else I can do I can simply click on new and there we go now from here I can take line start creating you are running a full size app inside an ipad and again this is possible because we are running this ipad as a wireless external display so let's see how we can achieve that for that first of all um let me take you to my ipad screen and here what we need to do is we need to go to app store after opening app store search for the app name as space desk and the good thing about this app as i said before is it is absolutely free unlike duet or other application that not only going to charge you but they're going to charge you in a reoccurring way which is kind of subscription but here the good thing about this space desk is that you do not need to pay even a single penny and if we talk about the quality of the app i would say it is quite decent now here you can see i already have installed this app in my ipad i am seeing open option here but if you are opening this for the first time you will see get option will be available there and one more thing here i want to show you is the rating of this app this app have fantastic 4.5 star out of 5 how good this app is stable now um, here it also talk about how one can install it so here in this case uh, we have completed our first step which is installing this app in our ipad now let's switch to my computer screen now here what i'm going to do is i'm going to open my internet browser and now i'm going to type space desk again after typing space desk let's click here on on its website and not to worry guys i'm going to also provide you the direct url of this site in the description of this video now um, let's click here on download now from here we need to choose our windows version and unfortunately this app is not available inside mac os but again the good thing was it is available for ipad now here i'm going to select windows 10 11 64 bit and it is pretty small guys now let's simply cl double click on it to install now let's click on next and in this way guys we will able to install it now again it's not like you only can install it in ipad you can also make your old laptop as secondary display just by downloading the driver onto it and there we go guys here we can see we have successfully installed it and make sure you install this server one because this is the server or main system and this is the client which was our ipad that we have installed now what i'm gonna do here is i'm gonna press windows button now let me type here space desk driver console and let's run it now when you run it here you will see it looks like this now you can make it password protected as well um, by enabling it 
but for that you require commercial license pure app but in case of home users most of the time we do not need any kind of encryption or password when i'm gonna connect my ipad to this network now i'm gonna keep all these settings as it is now what i'm going to do is i'm gonna connect both my system which is my pc this is connected through ethernet to my network and my ipad is actually connected to wi-fi with same network so just you need to make sure that both your devices are in same network and now what we need to do here is again i'm gonna go back to my ipad screen now what i'm gonna do here is i'm going to click on this space desk that we have installed let's click on it and there we go you can see i previously had connected my display where i was showcasing you how we can run you know any kind of app for example this autocad to this display but um, let's actually disconnect it and then i'm gonna again connect it back okay so now i have disconnected the space desk now again i'm gonna click on space desk and there we go now it shows my server ip that we have installed in my windows desktop now simply i need to click here on this ip and there we go we are back again here and now in this way guys my ipad became a secondary display and i can run and see anything from my pc in my laptop and in this way guys we can utilize our ipad as an external display can use it as a touch screen laptop and that too for free with microsoft windows i hope guys you find this video helpful and informational if you have any kind of doubts or question in your mind regarding this whole setup and process please do let us know in comment down below and please be subscribed to our channel to see more such productivity tips and tricks and i will catch you soon with one such another video till then you take care and bye bye